Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Just a short video today. Just going to go through some of my sort of favourite horror bits which I've got on this uh, little display cabinet. I don't have many because I don't really do collectibles too much, to be honest. But these are my favourite bits. Right up here, I've got me, uh, me Chucky doll, which is really, really cool. Still in its box. And next to it is me Michael Myers mask, which you can see there, which is quite cool too. Now we're going down into the display cabinet. Got some of my favourite box sets. Obviously the original Halloween DVD box set, which has got like all of them up to H2O. It doesn't have resurrection, but it's got the ones up to then. Then there's the... Uh, the um, Second Sight Dawn of the Dead box set, which is a 4K box set, which contains about three or four different versions of the film and loads of extras in there. Then, of course, my prize possession, The Witch, um, Second Sight 4K box set, which is absolutely awesome, which my lad Lemon Lord bought for me. Absolutely love it. Let's see if that glare helps take that light off. Nah, it's a bit too dark, in it? <laughs> So yeah, the witch. Underneath that is my hammer collection. And that's got about 20 odd, 21 discs in there. So it's got 21 movies. And in front of that is my Michael Myers bobblehead. Which again, my lad bought me. I think he bought this from uh, America. When he went to America. So there's some of my favourites. And just there in front of that is the CD soundtrack. Of John Carpenter's Halloween, the original 1978. So there's some of my favourite sort of movie box sets, which are really, really cool. Next shelf down is a little bit dedicated to Friday the 13th. Um, got the Friday the 13th Crystal Lake Memories book there. Slip case is a little bit, the uh, dust cover, sorry, is a little bit um, torn in that. But hey, that's okay. Um, I think I bought it second hand anyway. Um, so that's really cool. Then I've got my only um, Jason Voorhees figure. I uh, don't have uh, many others, but this is really cool. I'll take the mask away for a minute. And it's got some, uh, it's like got a different face there. You can change the head with a different mask, damage mask on it. Uh, I think this one is from um, the final chapter, I believe. It's got your Pamela Voyeur's uh, gravestone there. His machete and a cleaver and a different hand and a axe that's really really cool see if we can zoom in a bit on it yes yeah, the final chapter so this is from friday the 13th part four it's really really cool some great detail in that figure and there's the gravestone never opened it um just i i, I it's not because i'm click you know don't open it for any value reason or nothing like that it's just because i know I'll, I'll lose all the little bits you know so there's no real point doing that and obviously i've got the uh jason Voorhees mask let me just pop that down gently because i don't want it to make the shelf fall down or anything i'll show you that in a second and there's the jason Voorhees mask with the uh the cut there which he obviously received in the um i believe friday the 13th part three when he got the axe to the head so yeah that's cool it's a wearable mask it's got the proper straps on it just like jason's so it is wearable not that i'm gonna wear it you know to tesco's or anything but there we go that's me a uh, friday the 13th shelf so we're going to go down one more shelf here First thing I've got there is a book. Uh, it's the Italian Al Eaten Alive, Italian cannibal and zombie films, which is really, really cool, cool book. And there's that 80s toy, which I've had since I was a child. That's your Boglins. Still got that. Looking a bit for wear now, but it will come up with a bit of a clean, but I've put it in there because it's like a horror toy and it's cool. In front of that, I've got my favourite zombie film of all time, George A. Romero's Day of the Dead, 
that's the arrow version which is really cool two disc 25th anniversary it's got loads of sort of like uh, booklets photo cards in there and different versions of the movies and things now that's the that's cabinet the dr galligari do you remember i did a review on my channel of that that's that still book that's in here because there's only two thousand of these made so that's one of my collectible items don't have many and behind that is my chucky box set which includes all seven movies from the uh, franchise of uh, child play now that's that shelf it's pretty cool and the bottom shelf it's a little bit of an alien theme going on there got like a little mini post at the bottom of some artwork from a uh, from alien some of the prototype drawings of it and there's the soundtrack and there's a little pop vinyl of the alien image book and there's a book there called the vaults which is all the, got all different sort of things it's got like um um blueprints of like the ship and everything like that which is really cool and of course we've got the alien blu-ray box set which contains all the movies apart from the prometheus and here's a cool little figurine that i've got from uh a gift one year so that's my little alien shelf obviously i do have other alien things i've got the 4k films and stuff i just didn't want to put them all into a display cabinet so that's pretty much my my collectible horror stuff so it's going to be just a little short video but like i said i don't have many collectibles but anyway guys i hope you liked seeing it look after yourselves and i hope i'll see you all soon